Judith Arlene Resnick. I was an American electrical engineer, software engineer, biomedical engineer, pilot, and NASA astronaut. I was the fourth woman, the second American woman, and the first Jewish woman of any nationality to fly in space, logging 145 hours in orbit. At age 28, I was selected by NASA as a mission specialist. I was part of NASA Astronaut Group 8, the first group to include women. While training on the astronaut program, I developed software and operating procedures for NASA missions. My first space flight was the STS-41D mission in August and September 1984, the 12th space shuttle flight and the maiden voyage of Discovery, where my duties included operating its robotic arm. On January 29, 1985, NASA announced that I had been assigned to the crew of STS-51L. The main objective of this mission was to launch TDRS-B, the second in a series of NASA tracking and data relay satellites. It would also carry the Spartan, which would use two ultraviolet spectrometers to study the tail of Comet Halley. I was primarily responsible for the operation of the RMS, and with fellow astronaut Ronald McNair, would deploy and later retrieve the Spartan. The flight would also carry Krista McAuliffe, a teacher selected as part of NASA's Teacher in Space project. At 11.39 a.m., on January 28, 1986. Challenger broke apart 73 seconds into its flight. The cause of the disaster was the failure of the primary and secondary redundant, O-ring seals in a joint in the shuttle's right solid rocket booster, SRB. The 25th space shuttle mission and it has cleared the tower. Control, Challenger. Control program.